Hi friends, welcome to my channel TotalQA.com. Today we're going to focus a new topic on how do we import the GitHub Maven repository into Eclipse. So let's quickly get into the steps. How do we achieve this? So the first step, open Eclipse and in the right in the package explorer, right click, select import and the option as kit and select the clone URI option. Provide all the details required for cloning the repository. Close the dialog of the import projects from kit in between the steps and under the package explorer, try to re-import the project into Eclipse as an existing Maven project. Then we are done. We should be focusing on reviewing the code by adding breakpoints. These steps helps to import any repository into Eclipse and start focusing on the logic. Okay, so now let's get into the demo part to understand these steps very well. Okay, so for that, I will just navigate to the Eclipse. I already opened my Eclipse. Now, I will try to right click in the package explorer, select the option as import and here there are a lot of options available. So my focus mainly here to import the git repository, expand the git repository here, the option here and select projects from git. Then the option, the projects from git is selected click on next button here then we have two options so in these two options as i said we are all always interested in cloning a repository because we wanted to understand the logic suppose i have a repository available online i am also interested to understand the logic how they have written right it is important for us to understand the logic Right? For that, we just select existing local repository. No, this option is not required because this option is helpful when you download the repository and try to select this option. But right now, we are not downloading the repository. We are cloning this repository directly into Eclipse. So for that, just select the option clone URI. Click on next button. So here, we have to provide the location of the GitHub repository. So, I have a repository already available that's created under TotalQA.com. This is one of the organization I have created. Guys, always in, if you are interested to know, there is an option where you can create a repository also or else you can create an organization. Under this organization, you can create multiple repositories. Okay, in GitHub. So, I created an organization, TotalQA.com. Under this, I am using a repository, Allure Reporting. This will be helpful in Selenium to generate reports. Generally, we are always depending on TestNG to generate reports, but there are so many reporting frameworks available in Selenium like Allure Report, Extend Reports. There are so many reporting frameworks available, so which you can explore. For that, I am trying to help you to export one of the, sorry, to import one of the framework, the reporting framework Allure. Uh, reporting. So let's focus on how do we get this uh, repository into our Eclipse. Right. So for that, first what we do is we just get the URI of the repository. So this is the URI of the repository. I just copy that, go to Eclipse back and just provide the URI as the location which I copied. I put it here then automatically the details will be filled. So now I'll give the location as total, I'll give the username as total QA9 is my um, user and try to give the password. Okay, then I click on next button. Fine, then I'm able to find the repository. Okay, and the branch which is available under the repository, it's master branch. I click on next button, right? And the remote name is origin and the branch is master. Yes, fine. I'll try to, uh, and also guys, where you want to import this repository? You can give any location. Suppose for example, 
I am interested. Okay, let it be like that. Just keep the location. Any location is fine. I'll just say, suppose for example, I am trying to download this repository into C directory. That's also fine. Okay, and click on next here. Right. It will take some time to show these options. But here, guys, if you look at it, there are three options available import existing Eclipse project, import using the new project wizard, import as a general project. Guys, if you look at the project which is available in the GitHub, it is a Maven project. You can find the pom.xml which is available. So it means that you have to select an option which is related to POM, which is related to Maven project. Do you have any option to select a Maven project? It is not a general project. We cannot select this as a new project feature because it's already available and it's not an existing local existing uh, Eclipse project because we are downloading this repository from GitHub. So all these three options are not suitable for us to import this project right now. So what we can do now, what we can do is we can click on, click on cancel here. Don't continue this process. It will not help you to import a Maven repository available in GitHub. Okay. So the easiest process is you have to click on cancel. Don't continue all the steps. But once you see this, once you see these three options, click on cancel to terminate the process now. Then again, I right click on the package explorer select import here and under maven you will find existing maven project click on next here and you have given the location where you have downloaded as allure reporting or I'll just click on browse or just click on enter let me browse that would be better right just give a minute and try to select the location of it right so like this okay right so i'm able to select the location as a reporting this is the location which i had given to download this repository into this location locally then it is able to identify the pom.xml file click on finish then it will take some time we can select the option this option so that it will run in the background so once this project is totally imported successfully as a maven project you can even find see here the capital m that means it's a maven project and just wait for one more minute it will show this as a github repository it has a master branch associated with it Okay, and you can find all the files which are available. Suppose if I'm interested to understand this file, I can just open it and put a, a, a breakpoint and try to understand how this is working. Suppose I put a breakpoint here, and suppose I wanted to execute the code, I can right click on it, see debug as, and click on it's a Maven test. Right, so it is very helpful for us. In the cases where whenever there is a Maven repository available in GitHub, very simple, just try to select the option as a import the projects from Git, select clone URI, provide the URI and once you see a dialog box where you have three radio buttons, stop this process, terminate this, try to re-import the project as a Maven project. So this will be helpful for us to import the Maven project successfully and we are able to understand the logic by putting breakpoints or trying to execute the code to get a better understanding. Right. So thanks for watching this video. This will be helpful for you to import the project successfully as a Maven project into Eclipse. Thank you guys. Bye for now.